Hello, and welcome back to Factorio Vanilla 1.0. In our last episode, we started setting up some automation, including these basic assembly areas over here. Uh, let me do it this way. All the pollution. Uh, setting up these basic assembly areas over here, making gears and green circuits and belts, as well as, of course, science. And we started setting up some basic smelting arrays and making uh, level 1 um, ammo here. We have a little bit of furnaces being made here. We have coal, of course, being mined here. And I do want to set this output priority now so that the coal goes to fuel first. It's not balanced well, but that's fine. And then uh, iron is here, and we need to set up copper. So I finished building this uh, between the episodes. And, of course, I was attacked by biters because, well, this is Factorio with the biters on. And let's set these up. I want to position these well also. That would be a good position right there, of course. Maybe I'll just start like that. Do something a little different today. Although, maybe I'll do a few more. Do it this way. Oh, I can't do that way. Well, I'll just put it here for now. It'll be fine. And let's go down here. And of course, it's slightly out of alignment. Okay, and they're mining. And I want to go... I guess probably in here someplace. I didn't plan this very well. There's a surprise to everyone. Uh, let's do here. Alright, and then we can do this. I'll go one away just to be safe or something. We'll go in there, and that'll make our copper. Once it gets here. Uh, we probably are going to need more miners, but, well, we're almost out, actually. Uh, these are almost done. I'm going to burn these guys down and then get rid of them, because now that we have it automated, we don't need to do this anymore. I guess I could have taken some of these out. Then... Something like that. That didn't take long. And they're done. Okay. So let's put in a couple more of these here. And here. That won't quite give us enough, but it'll get it it'll give us enough to get started. And these have stopped again. How much more fuel do they have left? Probably time to take some of this stuff up. Lots of, lots of coal now. Okay, so today's objective is to go out and find those biters. And harry them a little bit. I wish, though, that I had... These are going to get affected pretty soon, too. I wish that I had the, um... Uh, what's it called? The armor first. But we haven't researched it yet. Although I guess I could swap it out. How many does that take? 30. Yeah, let's do that first. And then we'll go back to the weapon shooting speed and such. This shouldn't take too long. In the meantime, let's see. What can I do? What can I do to get this set up? I could make some uh, green circuits, I suppose. Let's do a few of these. Ten should be enough for now, I think. And I'm just going to set them up maybe over here. Is that right? I think that's right. I need to make it the same. Whichever way I do it, I need to make it the same. Okay, copper, of course. Copper wire. 
and green circuits. And then this will let us just continue that other green circuit array. So I did I did this without talking about it. But I'm going to talk about it now. Uh, green circuits, uh, each one takes one iron plate and three copper cable. Each copper cable machine, and that's uh, per half second of crafting time, ignoring the machine speed for right now. Each copper cable is produces two copper cables per half second of crafting time. So that means these two machines together need six copper cables every half second. And these three machines here will produce six co copper cables every half second. So that's what you call a nice ratio there. And we'll do this and that. And then... And then... A couple more of the red... There's a few different ways to build a green circuit array, and this is one of them. Uh, we go here and here. Let iron come in this way, and then we underground it like this. And then we can either do red inserters pointed outward. Actually, we don't need to underground it. We do red inserters pointed outward. Oh boy, here they come. Oh dear. Hello, my friends. There's one more over there. Look at that. It was stuck. Okay, uh, and then these can go out like this, and I've run out of belts. And then you have cop copper cable, copper plate rather, coming in here, like this. And then this is going to be a little small bus here. It's not doesn't really going to really matter too much because we're going to replace it. At least get us started with some items. And those some items, of course, being the copper or the, the green circuits. Let's see, do I want to do this? Yeah, let's do it. And then this one can go here, there, and we'll have to do these kind of like that. They're attacking because I'm making pollution. I'm making pollution to make them attack, I think. I don't know. And then you, 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 and you. Alright, that'll give us a few green circuits. Warps there. And then we can make like a little mini mall here. Of, of things that just just take these three items we don't need actually we'll probably put steel out here too but just we don't need much at this point how are we doing on power uh barely maintaining power how about another little bit of power Those have to be one away in order to accommodate this power pole. That's what we got there. And there and there. There's a few more of these to make, and then we need to make those pipes at the end so they can connect it together. Okay, and then a pipe at the end. And that doubles our power production. Come on, heavy armor. Oh boy, this is a nasty pollution cloud. I definitely need to start building some walls and start doing some choke points. Although getting rid of these burner miners would help quite a bit. Let's, let's just go ahead and take them up and pick up the fuel with them. And then I'm going to go put the fuel in, or the coal I should say, specifically, in these burners here, at least as much as I can. And then I'll put to figure out something else to do with it after that. Probably a box. I could be a little sneaky here. Do this. 
and this. Nope. There. And inserters always input onto the if they're I'm putting onto the edge of the end of the from the end of the belt like this, they always output onto the right side. Otherwise they output onto the far side if they're coming on sideways onto the belt. So that's something to uh, remember. How is this working? Should I do I should probably do a couple more of these. There. There. Get some power. I need to actually place that. Wait a minute. Oh, it's it's done. Okay, that's why. Uh was it again? Two iron to one. That's four. So we'll do two there, two there. Take those, and I'll put some more iron in here. Take these, and we're done with these now. These can always be taken up. We're not done with belts yet, so let's, uh, we'll make some more. And are you all done? You are all done. These miners just don't look like they're working as well, because they they're not in a smooth animation. But they still are. Uh, yeah, go ahead and take them. Ah, uh, heavy armor is finally finished. So let's go back to the weapon shooting speed and make a heavy armor. Oh, I did have light armor already. Oh, I need steel for heavy armor. Well, crap. I forgot about that. Let's do a little bit of cheater steel right here. Coupled with this. Just make a bit. I should have already made the light armor though. That was kind of dumb. 50. 50. I totally forgot that there was armor that you got for free to start the game with. This is going to take a bit, so I, don't, I guess maybe I should just do without. Or I can uh, pause and come back. I think I will do that. I'll be right back. I tried to come back quickly, but I didn't, so uh, we just got attacked by a little group of biters here, and that's even more uh, reason to go out and find them and kill them. So I tried to get bring it back in so you guys could watch me kill the biters, but that's okay. I think we are here. We are here. No, there's only 44. I also can't count. Need six more. Okay, there should be a few more seconds then. Okay, that's 48. Oh, look, the copper's finally backing up. That'll slow the pollution down a little bit. Everything's kind of building up now, except for, of course, the ammo. We need to take a bunch more of that, too. I have two. Let me put, put this in here. Uh, I guess I should probably get rid of that pistol. Just set up a box here for this kind of stuff. There we go. Plenty. Okay, and the armor, and now let's go. Weapon shooting speed is done. That means we're going to do projectile damage next. I thought the creep was supposed to fade. 
after time. It's a lot of large rocks with coal in them. Ah, there's some biters. That might be the biters that are attacking. I don't really need the torch just yet, but... Don't need that many in there, that's for sure. Okay. Good. There. Oh, I need another turret. And I don't know why I didn't do that correctly the first time. Oh, that worm can reach there, too. It's a bummer. But I did it. Uh, repair pack, please. And that's how you kill biters. Kind of the wrong way. So what I want to do is I want to kind of walk around the perimeter here. And try and find the edge. Looks like there's a biter in there. Oh, there's a worm in there. Good. He's dead. Let me heal up a little bit. And there's some more biters down here. And try and find the edge of the pollution cloud. Another worm. Yeah, another small worm. I'm going to do it that way from now on. Let me make a few more of these. That should be a good clearing here. Uh, the pollution spreads faster over water, and then over sand, and then over grass and trees and such. Trees are really good for absorbing pollution. So I definitely want to have the trees here. Okay, that's, that's probably good to call it a direction. Let's go back up this way, because I'm sure there's more. And I did not defend my base, so hopefully these ones over here don't absorb too much pollution, because otherwise they're going to come and destroy everything. I also need to get some other stuff researched, like the car, as soon as possible, so I'm not walking around out here like this all the time. How far up? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is the ones we just killed. I guess I probably should have set up some defenses in the base, but I needed to get rid of these guys as quickly as possible, too. So, hopefully we can find the edge of the pollution cloud. We have found it. Okay. And there's biters up here, too. And it looks like not a small nest. Yay. Okay, there and there. Kill these guys. And then we can do this. Make a few more turrets. This is a uh, cheap turret creep. Oops. And I lost a turret. That's alright. Some repairs here. And splat. Okay, those weren't actually in the cloud, or if they were, they were barely in the cloud. But it doesn't hurt to take them out. While we're out here anyway. I'm going to go up a little bit more here. 
oh, find the edge of the cloud, hopefully. That would be really nice. Yeah, this would be a good place for a main bus, I think. Looks pretty clear. It had a lot of cliffs. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, indeed. All right, we're getting there. The pollution is spreading because there's no trees. Oh, there's entities being damaged. Doggone it. Well. We might be out of luck. Because I didn't leave defenses. Let me try and get back down there as quickly as possible. And let's make a couple more turrets. Make some more ammo. Oh no. Well, at least they're only destroying the stuff that I have a bunch of stuff sitting in. Ugh. Well, now I know I need to kill the ones down there in the southwest. That much is certain. Yes, thank you for killing everything, guys. All five of you, or whatever. Like three biters. Good thing, I guess. You know what? Just pick it up. Pick it all up. And I think I picked up an inserter that might be damaged. Or maybe not. Power poles damaged, though. Yeah, there's a damage inserter. Why didn't it put it down first? It really does. Okay, well, we'll go down this way, then. These trees are probably what saved me from those attacking me earlier than they did. Lump of trees means pollution absorption. Alright, so here we are. Do a little bit of this. Oops. Need a mining speed bonus too. I don't have to do the work, that's even nicer, you know? I can creep into their range here just a little bit. With your slime. Alright. I lost one turret that probably had a lot of ammo in it. It did, it did. Okay. Well, I think I should do a little bit more exploration this way. And I should probably put some radars out too. Let me make a couple of those. Then we can run power poles back to the base. That's a... Eh. Alright. Don't be a wuss, Wally. Be Mr. Fix It. You be Mr. Kill It. Good job killing it. You're killing it, guys. Alright. Enough with bad puns. Or not. 
there. Defense from the back here. Thank you, everyone. You did well. Okay. Let's go this way. And I want to find the sort of... Not as far south as I can go with the radar at this point, I think. But maybe like a, a radar grid south. Oh, dear. More biters. Um, am I going to have enough ammo? Yeah, I have 200 in my inventory. Or my gun. So, pick those up, put these down. You guys, there and there. Oh no, ow, ow, ow. Wally repair bot. Are you a medium worm? No, you're a small worm. How are you shooting so far? I didn't see that one coming after me. Wally repair bot again. Oh, I had less health than I thought I did. I almost died, folks. Well, that's the bottom of the cloud at least, so that's good. Let's go around this clump of uh, things here. Let me go into uh, radar, radar. I want to put this radar like up in here someplace. I can know where I need to find it when I come back. But I want to come over here and just make sure there's not any more biters over here to take out before we head back to the base. It looks pretty safe. A little bit more. A bit, a bit more. And yeah, there's some down there. Okay, let's do it. Uh, maybe. We have 200 ammo. I think I'm not going to do it. I'll come back and do it. Let's do the pickaxe. That'll increase our mining speed. Doubles it. I have enough power poles. I should have enough power poles at least to get myself back to the base with a power line for this. And then that'll help us scan out here further. I should probably put some defenses on it. Let's leave a turret here with it, and a bit of ammo. 25, no, how about 12? Yeah. And then uh, we'll go this way. Of course I did. Playing that one out well. Go this way with it. This is why I don't like water. And then I will go around this way. And now we will have a little bit more visibility on the map. Excellent. Off by one. All right, so now we have a little bit more visibility here and we still need to reveal this area up here. So I could potentially do the same kind of thing with another radar. Uh, let's see, let's go this way a little bit more to kind of square it up with the radar we have. Not that it matters a whole lot, but I don't know that I have my power poles anyway. Oh, that's a bummer. 
that iron patch would have been partial it would have been more revealed if there was less water. Where are we at as far as radars go? What is it out there in the model of water? No, actually, right about there. Uh, let's see. Oh. Alright, and that should take care of scanning uh, north as well. We need to go out east and west, but that can be done at another time, because we're now at about 30 minutes, and it's time to end the episode. So thank you all for joining me, and we'll, I'll see you again next time. Bye for now.